We are working new developments now on a drowning investigation. Two Fall River health inspectors are scheduled to appear before the disciplinary board today. They're being asked to explain why the Veterans Memorial Pool at Lafayette Park was not closed sooner. The body of Marie Joseph was discovered floating in that pool last month, but a medical examiner determined she had been dead for two days in that murky water before she was found. Eyewitness News reporter Nicole Estefan live now in Fall River with the latest developments. Nicole. Good morning, Danielle and Patrick. Two weeks after 36 year old Marie Joseph's body was found here floating in the Lafayette pool, you can see here on the ground people still stopping by and laying mementos in her memory. Now, this morning's disciplinary hearing is part of the DA's investigation into what happened here to try to figure out how the woman's body could go undetected for two days. The inspectors have been on paid administrative leave since June 29th. That's the day after Joseph's body was found here. Now, let's take a look at video eyewitness news captured in the days after we've been covering this story since it broke. Now, the inspectors were at the pool on June 28th and gave the facility a clean bill of health, noting only that the water was cloudy. All the while, Joseph's body lay at the bottom of the pool, hidden by that murky water. The death has been ruled accidental. The DA will determine if negligence by those responsible for the pool was involved. Eyewitness News spoke with Fall River's mayor about the hearing this morning. He said the two inspectors will have representation. They are represented by their own attorneys, uh, their union employees. Uh, they will have union representation at the hearing. Depending on the findings, there could be no action taken or the two inspectors could be terminated. We'll be sure to follow that hearing and bring you the details as soon as they become available. As far as Joseph, her body will be laid to rest today. Those ceremonies are private. We are live in Fall River with the Southeastern Massachusetts Mobile Newsroom. Nicole Estefan, Eyewitness News.